The ground, this Cactus 50, we're showing a fire on our number two engine. The engine is shut down. Is there any way you can roll trucks out here and get them to look at it for us? Hey folks, good evening once again from the flight deck. As you look out the windows and notice all the rain, the lightning and everything else, they, right now they have a uh, stop on all departures, so uh, we're looking for an additional extended delay here. Uh, we're just going to wait for this thunderstorm to pass, and they're going to reevaluate the uh, departure to the north and east. And once we find out some information, we'll be happy to pass it along to you. So just sit back, relax, enjoy the ride here, and uh, or sit here. And uh, once we once we know some more information, we'll pass it on. Thanks for your patience. Oh, thank you. Hey, nice PA, man. Very good job. Oh, sorry. Uh -huh. Well said. Hey, can we get some peanuts? Cost you two dollars. Can I use my cell phone? Tower, do you have anything to add to that? I have nothing to say. It's a great day. Why do we lean the mixture? We lean the mixture to maintain the fuel and air ratio. What ratio are we trying to maintain? 1 is to 14.7. 1 is to 14.7 is the stoichiometric ratio for fuel to burn efficiently. It basically means that for every 1 pound of fuel, you need 14.7 pounds of air to burn the fuel completely. If you have more fuel than air, then the extra amount of fuel would be wasted or unburned, will not burn properly. If you have less amount of fuel than the air, then you won't be generating enough power. That's why you need to maintain 1 is to 14.7. Most engines are calibrated in a way that they maintain this ratio at sea level. What happens when we climb? When we climb to higher altitudes, the air outside becomes less dense. If we are talking about a normally aspirated engine, it is taking in the air from the outside directly without turbocharging, without compressing it using a turbocharger or a supercharger. In that case, the amount of air molecules entering the engine reduce as we climb because the air is becoming less dense. Then we would have excess fuel compared to the air and this will cause some amount of fuel to remain unburnt. This unburnt fuel can cause spark plug fouling and problems with the engine. Hence what we have to do is we have to reduce the amount of fuel to match with the amount of air 1 is to 14.7. This is done using leaning. And if you want me to go a little more deeper into leaning, please comment down below and I will make a detailed explanation of why we lean and I might take an example of the Cessna 172 or any of the normally aspirated engines, help you understand how the leaning procedure works.